What's up, y'all? So today we will be doing a video on um, Black-owned restaurants and coffee shops in New York City. Um, so me and Ari have a blog. It's a lifestyle um, travel blog that highlights restaurants, coffee shops, hotels, um, boutique shops, just around the world, around New York um, when we travel. Um, all that to say, we felt that we should use our platform to highlight Black-owned restaurants and use our services, um, how we use them, in a way that could help our community. Um, so what better way than to do what we do um, for our people? So we have about four restaurants, about three to four. We're still waiting on confirmations as we're like going along the day. Um, but we have a few and I figured this would be enough since we had enough um, for today I figured this would be great to bring you guys along with me um, but yeah so let's head out all right so we're outside our drip and we're gonna head in and meet Nigel the owner and take some photos uh, all right let's do it Bye, Nigel. Take care, man. Thanks. All right, y'all. So we just left uh, Nigel, who is a super cool guy and drip coffee. Um, obviously, we'll have the details in the description. Um, yeah. All, wherever it should be, that's where it will be. I don't know. I always mess up when it's like in the description. No, I keep it. It's, it's real. Um, all, and now we're off to Harlem and uh, to shoot The Edge, Lolo's. Veneteria. Veneteria. And possibly maybe 67 North Street. If they can get back to us in time. All right, y'all. Back on the road. All right, so we made it to Lolo's. It's a cute seafood shack. And we placed our order. And then we're gonna take a couple of photos of the owner and the sky, and then we will go to the next part. Yeah. And the founder, we're locally owned, locally operated. I'm the one who's born and raised here in Harlem. And some kind of like chifa menu items, which is kind of like inspired by like. So we just finished up at Lolo's, and uh, by the way, the food is super bomb. We, Soft uh, shell crab, chef's kiss. You heard 
get here first. Uh, now we're headed to the edge to shoot some more, obviously. Um, but yeah, let's keep it going. Yo, so we, sorry, the edge, it was too bang bang. We really didn't have time to really get any video. Yeah, these things have been we're back kinda, to back and. To be honest with you, we we're behind schedule. You wouldn't have known that if we didn't tell you, but we've been behind schedule. So shooting video on top of it seemed a tad bit inconsiderate and just, uh, just it was just hard to get the timing right. Um, here are those photos from the edge. <laughs> All right, y'all, so I wanted to hop in really quickly just to say that towards the end of the shoot, we, we sort of ran out of time and when we made it to Vinateria, they're not actually cooking any dishes. So we just stopped to get a quick portrait of Yvette, who is the owner at Vinateria in Harlem, which you'll see in a second. But I just wanted to thank everyone for watching. I um, always appreciate every view, every watch, every comment. It's, it is as much appreciated. Um, give Aria a follow on Instagram. And uh, I'll see you guys in a couple of days. Peace.